I think it was very useful last year because I think that the, the new system uh, introduced by the, the, the new film fund uh, that was the actual the first uh, uh, meeting uh, with, the, with, the, with the foreign experts, as far as I remember, for last year. And since that time, I mean, there were a few grants already uh, uh, declared, and uh, evidently the, the application started. So I think it's a good chance to talk about it again. year zero for new Hungarian cinema, you might say. Now it's year one of new Hungarian cinema and we're going to find out what has been going on in the last year. I think we have a system that really works. We have a system that I'm sure we have a lot of uh, issues and we have a lot of growing pain. We will have a lot of growing pains because we're only eight months old. I would like to uh, congratulate you all on getting the train back running, whether it's running in the right direction, at the right speed, and with the right conductors and drivers is another discussion for the future. But if we look back one year, uh, I think you've come far down the road. I know in a way that you know we are applying and, and we get some, sometimes funded, but it's really the beginning. The work is just about to start. I have to say that I didn't think a year ago that I would feel as optimistic as I feel now from what I've learned so far. For me, this was a, a very th a short but deep insight into the uh, situation of Hungarian filmmaking and film funding at the moment. They want the money in their own hands. They want to distribute among themselves. I'm sorry, that is not my job. That's not what I was appointed for. I was appointed to clean up the mess. I've done it. Whatever any head of national agency does, it's painful and it's, it's let's say, causing trouble, you know, to professionals. You know, this selection process is a very painful. Like any audition, any reading is always painful. You must say no to people. You must hurt people's expectations. You must take very, very harsh and tough decisions. And so, we think, I think it's, it's necessary that people really embrace and support the bad guy who's going to give them bad news. It was interesting to come back after a year and uh, sort of revalue what we've done and for me to hear it also what we've done because all day long I'm working and doing I have very little time to reflect. So I think this was very useful to see how far we've gotten in this last year. It's okay, it's acceptable that the politics named the government commissioner. But I don't think that's acceptable that the government commissioner uh, named the member, the member of the boards without, without a consensus by the filmmakers. The reason why, the, why I appointed these people is because I wanted a group that, I, that we can trust, a group that will be there day and night, that we can depend on, that will not be giving money to their friends or their acquaintances, but they will be solely judging the material that they're receiving. And I think we've accomplished that. I'm very happy that the Hungarian found system is going back to Europe and uh, with the big plans to do an international European co-production. We are definitely very happy with it and we are uh, definitely open to cooperate on, on some kind of minority or majority co-productions. You always found some good ideas, some good practice, some bad practice, and uh, if you cross the the thoughts, you know, there's no general recipe how to work or how to behave. It's just a question of believing what can fit and function in your in in each country system the best. It was rather practical and quite professional. I thought I expected it to be a much more delicate afternoon than it turned out to be. It's been an interesting discussion. It reminds me a little bit of going to a dinner party where uh, the host and the hostess start arguing. It's mildly embarrassing but also very interesting. <laughs> and of course as a guest the clever thing to do is not to take sides. And if you do take sides, take the side of the wife. I 
actually think what the uh, uh, Collegium Hungaricum has done in these last years has been uh, positively very, very helpful, very contributing to uh, the development of the, of the dialogue, of the debate. Uh, somehow people come, you know, to the Bellinale, uh, they're away from home, and it gives a little bit of uh, perspective.